Waking up to a cold house in the winter or a hot house in the summer is the worst, and it means you need to call your local HVAC company and maybe even our friends at Advanced Climate Care. And that's exactly what Kevin of Girdle Tree, Maryland did. Check it out. Just like any other morning, I come downstairs and I'm like, that's, that's wrong. That doesn't feel right. Looked at the thermostat and it was down to like, 30-ish, yeah, yeah, and my pets are looking at me like, what did you do, you know? And so when we called Advanced Climate Care, uh, they were able to come out the very next day. I didn't have to wait too long at all. It was amazing, it came out very next day, thank goodness. So our office received a call from Kevin and uh, it was, I believe it was late on a Sunday night and we were out that Monday morning. It was an easy call. You know, it just went very smoothly. They were, they were out here super duper quick. And it was, I want to say less than 10 minutes before they found out that it, my, my unit was fine. And it was actually an issue with the circuit breaker. Uh, I believe it was Jason who saw that it was an electrical issue. And he's like, hey, good thing I came today, <laughs> you know? We came out and uh, went through, took a few minutes to go through and actually find the problem. Uh, found it in the electrical panel. Uh, luckily, Snow Hill uh, has a hardware store, um, so we were able to go to the hardware store and luckily had the part that we needed there, uh, breaker that we needed for his electric panel, was able to install that and get his heat back up and going. I uh, actually thought he was having a heating issue. Heat wasn't working, and uh, our electrician came out that day and uh, replaced a breaker, and it wasn't actually a, a problem with the heat. Uh, we did go through and check the heat out once we had it fired up, but the initial problem was actually an electrical problem. We are uh, licensed for electrical, and uh, Kevin moving forward, you know, we fixed the breaker in the panel um, to get him going for now, but as we were in that panel and doing the work that we did, um, we noticed that he, you know, has some um, arcing and, and um, deterioration in that panel, which needs to be replaced, so we're going to We've given him a quote and uh, we will be replacing the electrical panel and making it a more safer uh, situation for him. The, the fuses that I need got replaced, but the, the base plate in my uh, circuit breaker, it needs to be replaced. That, that does need some work. And moving forward with advanced uh, climate care, I'm gonna be going replacing that circuit breaker. And they're also gonna be putting insulation on everything, making sure that it's not a fire hazard. That should be a pretty important move on an old house, I think. <laughs> Companies totally could show up and be like, ah, this is, uh, I don't like how the guy, other guy did it. You're gonna need, all this needs to come out. If we could just take all this out, we're gonna put in a brand new one for you. We'll send you a bill, you know? No, and it wasn't like that at all. They came in, looked at it, and actually took the time to find out that it was an electrical problem. Totally could have been like, nah, let's gut it. But yeah, thankfully they were, very, very meticulous about making sure that it was a repairable issue instead of a replaceable one. So, uh, you know, Kevin had mentioned to us, uh, you know, he was worried about having to replace it uh, and had been told before that he had to replace the system. Um, and as like we always tell folks, uh, we're, we'd rather repair it than replace it. So when we come to the job, we're in re repair mode. Um, so we go through we find the problem, you know, unless it's something that's really horrible. Uh, generally speaking, most systems can be fixed, but if there is an issue that it needs to be replaced, we're obviously going to point you in the right direction, but we're always going to repair before replace. That heat came back on real quick. I was able to call my boss and finish out a shift that day. I didn't have to, you know, worry about missing another day of work. The heat was great. My pets were like, oh my God, Kevin, thank you so much, but where's my food, you know? It's a beautiful thing when the pets can smile too once we've uh, fixed their heat or air AC in, in the summertime. Um, customers, uh, you know, our reviews speak volumes and, and we're just so happy to, to help the customer when we can. Advanced Climate Care got picked, I think, because they're a reliable name. Uh, I believe that they've got a reputation for making sure the job gets done correctly as opposed to just as soon as possible. Um, if anybody is having any kind of, whether it's an, an HVAC issue or heating issue, I highly recommend this company, um, especially for that same reason. They, 
it's hard to find somebody that's going to be reliable and truthful and honest, right? And Advanced Climate Care certainly was. Bobby was fantastic. And I highly recommend, if, if your heat goes out, give them a call. They will set you up right, okay? You're not going to be freezing forever. <laughs> that's part of the re rewarding part of uh, being an HVAC technician, having an HVAC company, is seeing people light up when you're able to fix their problem. It's more of a family feel here. Uh, we, we try to uh, repair before replace and we try to make the customer comfortable in that aspect and treat them like family and um, hopefully leave with a smile on their face.